how's it going? Y'all ready for 12 hour Ma Maho Kenji? 12 hour. Uh, Morty! Morty! 100 years, Maho Kenji! Maho Kenji! Forever, Morty! Woo! Starting the stream with, with the Rick and Morty reference. Yeah. Good job. Good job. I sure hope my stream is working. Give me a second. Ba 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 ba. Do do do. I don't think I care for this song actually. All right, so when last we left our uh, intrepid adventures, we um, we just arrived at this new town. And I had forgotten everything. We got to Korsha. And um, there's something to do over here. Vanquish the Vivius uh, gang. We also have to find the artifacts hidden in St. Elior Abbey. Uh, help requested corpse looters. Some people were spotted looting corpses. Well, we got bills to pay. So let's go ahead and uh, head southwest. I want some lo-fi Katamari music. I wonder if that exists. That would be top tier. Oh no, I have to make camp. No, I don't have enough food. Oh, I have tons of food. Never mind. I haven't even cooked up my lamb. Let's just make camp right in front of those uh, <laughs> potential villains. Uh, oh wow, we've got a ton of food actually. So first we're gonna cook up this mutton. What is this? Each region has its own scenario and you can follow its progress here. You haven't started the scenario for this region yet. What? I did not know that. I thought that there was like one main campaign. Can learn recipes and cook apprentice dishes. Has become an apprentice cook. Yo, let's go. That's freaking poggers, my dude. Um, people are happy right now, so maybe I should generate a little bit of extra. Here, we'll put the, we'll put the, uh, the dude in the camp. Generate a little bit of extra valor. And, um, yeah, let's eat some food. Oh, except this stupid guy is a drunkard, and so therefore we have to continue generating happiness. That's annoying. I gotta get rid of this guy. Are these six food each? Yeah, they are. So I'm always gonna be eating a little bit of surplus. And he also wants five meat. Oh my god, what an annoying person. That's fine. How's everyone doing? How how are y'all? Um, troops happiness increased by three. So he generated 15 run, uh, influence. Oh, Mimi's got something to say. The world is much bigger than I anticipated. It feels like I could spend my life traveling and still never visit the same place. Grumble all day long. That sounds like something that Mimi would do. Celebrate. Yeah, we're probably gonna celebrate. Nice. Whoa, that generated a ton of influence. Damn, son. Alright, um... 
Where are we going? We're going over here. We have to find the corpse looters. Bow, 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 bow. Bow, bow. It might be them actually right there. Of course, now we're looting some corpses ourselves. There's some wolves over there and boars. I think that's them right right there. Those are the corpse looters. We got a very different landscape here right now, which is kind of nice. Would you like to buy this map? It is all I have left for my old life, but my children need food more than they need weapons. Yeah, all right, sure. 10, 10 coinage, sure. Oh, did you really just buy it? Thank you, thank you so much. Oh, did you just scam me? I mean, it was only 10 coins, so. Uh, I'm gonna steal your wheat in return. Stolen. Get stolen on, ma'am. I'm gonna steal your other wheat too. <laughs> oh no. <gasps> Villain campaign has begun. Ah, Nevelina Wong has become a thief apprentice. Heck yeah, bud. We're starting on a strong note today. Anything else I can steal? No? I've been needing wheat for a long time, so. Um, we gotta take these guys to prison. I don't, I don't know where the prison is. Poor woman scams you for, to feed her children. Steal all her food. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hello, de dear colleagues. What am I doing, you ask? Why, well, I'm looting dead bodies, of course. No need to look so appalled. I am sure you you have done the same to many of your own victims. See, I was not mistaken. You really are my colleagues. Oh, we could recruit them. You have nothing in common with these vultures. I mean, I have tons in common with these vultures, but I will get paid if I fight them. Um... We could probably do with an extra recruit. We're only five people right now. What do y'all think? What do, what do you think, chat? This is actually a pretty good price. Since I'm only paying Renown, it's actually a pretty good price for this person. And they could become Imatan. I'm better myself. I'm just reading chat. I'm going to recruit her. You have just completed the mission. Help requested. Oh, cool! That completes the mission as well. That was an easy, easy take. We get her at level three, which is great. Starting on a really high note, they need some better weaponry though. We're gonna turn this stolen wheat into bread. And for that we need salt. I like this song. Um, let's hand in that quest first. Steal her children to really get back at her. Okay, we collected some money. Are there any other quests? Rat infestation. I will never do another rat infestation ever. Free old customs post. Nah. So we just got a new person. We gotta outfit them. That's gonna take a little while since I don't have enough, too many resources or money. I've, I've been like for the last several sessions trying desperately to stay ahead of the curve on like food and money and stuff like that We can we get some salt. Yes, we can get some salt How does one make bread I forget 
Uh, oh, it's just wheat and salt. So we just need 11 salt. Fantastic. No more rat infestations, but I thought you loved rats. I love rats. I love uh, tame rats, not diseased rats. Now, um, what I wouldn't mind grabbing is... Uh, oh, okay, we can't buy any iron from here. Spices, gems, spices, and pelts. Interesting. What do you have? Maybe I'll see you guys strike me down if I lie. I saw him, I swear, these three days ago. Okay, yeah. Greetings, all. So we just got ourselves an Imatan. Um, they are similar fighting style to Mimi. Poisoned Impact. Deal six damage to all the units in the area. Applies two poison to bleeding units. Ah, uh, that's a weird one. Deals 5 to 6 damage. Re damage reduced by 50%. What did I miss? Um, I completed a quest by recruiting the, the villains, and the villain is now Imatan. That's that's the biggest thing you missed. Mimple hates rats. I'm gonna go Destroyer. We get to take another one. Unit gets deflection if they are engaged in combat. Every time an attack hits several enemies, you gain one. Every time this unit engages in combat, you gain one. I, I like Valor's duel. I think it's just like an easy take. Um, and we'll do strength. Oh, I get another one. We'll take Constitution as well. Okay, so Imatan is now on the same level as us. We do actually have some iron, so what I'd like to do is find out um, what kind of equipment we should make and also weapons for Imatan. Imatan also needs a profession. What kind of profession do you want, Imatan? Uh, reinforced plate armor. Oh my god. Just about anything. I- can I Matan take plate armor? That could be kind of good. I can't remember what he's allowed to take. Heavy equipment. So I'm a tan could take plate armor. Let's forge him some plate armor. Wait, what level do you have to be? Uh, it doesn't say, so I'm gonna see if you can be any level. Shoot. Okay, well, it could have been worse. Um, I don't think I can make a hammer. I really want to get some more, uh, like, make some more armor. What professions aren't taken? Um, you could be the scholar. You could be the scholar, you could be the bard. I think you wanted to be the bard, didn't you? You could be the, the angler. That's it, that's just, it's just E3. I think you said you wanted to be the bard, didn't you? Can learn songs and sing them in taverns. It would be funny and fun if you could tame a giant rat. Bard it is. I just got you some really nice armor. You have better armor right now, officially, Amatan, than anyone else in the group. No joke. Um, okay. So that's good. We... I... I would like to learn how to make hammers. I don't know how to make a hammer right now. You have either Adorian Restoration or Adorian. Um, 
yeah let's see here if i was to learn how to make hammers or like a cudgel or something experience blacksmith set one learn the following uh beck de corbin axe ulfbert sword I don't know if I can figure it seems oh there we go there's a hammer right there so we would have to learn the apprentice set too which would teach me the two-handed mace or the claymore I've been spending a lot of my points learning uh, recipes and stuff I kind of like to learn more of these like improved restoration would be really nice Rationing would be kind of nice. We'll figure it out. My weapons look like straight out of Blight Town. <laughs> yeah, you, they actually really do. <laughs> they do. It's a shame I, I uh, had a ton of weapons, but um, you know, I, I had to sell them all to make make enough money to, to live. You know. Um, so our, our next quest is we got to go and defeat the Vil Vivios gang. So let's go ahead and do that. Hey, but you know, the, the good news is, lads and lass, is that, um, we have money and food now. Like, we're actually kind of on top of things. That, that is the bad right there. I just want to get this business over here at some point I'm sure I'm gonna have to fight them is this the Vivios gang here no it's not the Vivios gang is over here could be it could be them right there actually combat your companions have just ambushed their targets and will have an advantage in the fight yay money i'm a bonk <laughs> you're gonna get the bonk some people <laughs> i'm a bonk is pretty good i forget what um this does damage taken increased by 10%. Oh, that's not that great. Is this the first time I've done a combat with uh, the prisoner? Is the prisoner even in combat right now? I don't see them, so I'm assuming they're not in combat. All right, let's uh, let's get Imatan in there and crack some skulls. Imatan has deals five to six damage to the target damage is increased by 50% if target still has armor um, So yeah, let's get them let's get them in there I should have done a weakening blow first. Oh well I'll just leave it uh, Like that for now Whoa, that guy's got some crazy movement Nevelina Wong, um, why don't you go ahead and go over here and engage this guy? Does this also have this attack ignores guard? Oh, that was a nice hit. Let's also use a weakening blow. I should have used a weakening blow first. I, I did that again. Uh, we'll go ahead and kill this guy. Gained fury. I need to a rename to I'm a bonk then. Okay, I'll change it to I'm a bonk. One damage. Yo. Um, just gonna come over here and like absolutely destroy this one lad. I'm not even gonna use a thing. Oh no. Oh, you missed it. Hit your own friend. Oh, that sucks for you, dude. Okay, let's get over here. 
and smack this dude these guys are very easy they're just like whatever bandits oh no poison okay mimesis uh mimesis you're in a bad position right now um so what i'd like to do is i'm gonna have you go here and charge through this guy uh that killed the dude that i actually wanted you to attack well that's fine um let's do something i don't know let's do like this And he'll walk up to her, do a bit of damage, poison, that's not good, but that's fine. Um, poor Lay. Poor Lay, you are gonna run over here and kill this guy. We could kill him. Yeah, let's kill him. Let's not mess around. And then we could do a poison bomb. Let's do a poison bomb. are actually doing some really good stuff in this combat. Oh no. Oh, okay, five damage, big whoop. He took three damage from the poison. Okay, now we're in the second combat. Um, what I'd like to do, I, I'm just wondering if there's any way I could get Mimesis to uh, attack multiple people at once, but I don't know if that's the case. I'm just gonna run over here and Actually, if I was to go like here, ah, this is actually not a bad idea. I'll go here. This is, that surrounds this guy, and it's also more likely that this guy will want to come like here and get smacked by Mimi. And also, I can do some damage to this guy. Oh, never mind. We killed him. <laughs> oh shoot. Oh no, poor Lay. Oh, uh, he's got uh, a bow. I didn't notice the bow, so he's never going to come over here. I don't know why I thought that. Okay, um, so we're just going to go over here and absolutely pulp this guy. Get absolutely destroyed. 28 damage. Oh my god. Calm down. Oh my god, Mimesis absolutely destroyed that guy. Do you want to let them go and win the battle? No. We're going to capture this dude. Uh, that was a mistake. Oh man, no one's like this guy's in mud, so they're not gonna be able to move all that much This guy's actually got kind of an advantage right now <laughs> This guy's just like watching my entire troop descend upon him Oh, oh ouch This guy is taking a little bit of damage Okay, now we absolutely just, just stomp this dude. Wait, what? Where's Granoff? Is he not? Oh, he was like literally one step away from him. And we'll do a destabilizing strike. Oh, that's apparently going to kill him. All right, never mind. We're not going to capture anyone. It's fine. All right. Uh, no one's injured, which is great. You've reached level two in the crimes and something. Oh Nice We got a damage dagger. Uh, we got some cloth and money. We got some renown. We got some experience um, Can repair everyone for four materials cactus leveled up It's all kind of coming up right now. Now. Let me see. Where is that? Uh, compendium no uh, Paths here we go crimes and chaos Access to assassination missions in the list of bounties. Five battles won in ambush. Two battles won alongside outlaws. 102 crowns saved by stealing. 
Battles won against the guard. Hours spent being wanted. Battles... What do you mean hours spent? You mean like in-game or like out of game? Battles won in ambush. Stolen items. We're, we're <laughs> slowly increasing on that one. Assassination missions completed. Prisoners recruited. We, rec we could recruit that one prisoner and then just to banish him. You know what? We should do that. Let's let's recruit this guy. Henchman. Trust. Well fed. Appreciates the troops company. Um Treat injury. You do not have any medicine for this injury. I don't know how to release him. Or recruit him, I guess. What if I like went into camp mode? Also, was that the was that the mission? That was not even the mission. That wasn't the mission. What? Vanquish the Vivios gang. Improv improvised burning steak. That's where I am. I need to find the Vivios gang. Okay, that's that's them. I did not uh, succeed in ambushing them. That's fine. I should have leveled up Cactus though. I think Cactus is level five, four now or five. Okay, I know this battlefield well. Um, what, what these guys get? What? This unit always deals critical hits. What the heck? Um, okay, so we can't just like split up the group right like this. We're gonna have to have a couple of people in the center. We're gonna put have a uh, Porle, Imatan, and um, Cactus in the center here because we're gonna have to try and kill this Vivios the Cheeky. Cheeky Breaky, you know? You know? Um, all right, so. Uh, I'm a I'm a ten. Let's have cactus engage This dude so he can get rid of that crit like right away um Okay crit gone that is good and we're gonna go ahead and use deflection because or protection because uh He's probably gonna get attacked by this dude. Yep. So that's it's good that I use protection. Oh no, poison. This early in the game, that's not good. Okay, we're gonna use the poison now. Because the thing is as soon as I engage Porlay in any kind of combat, he doesn't get his freedom to like throw things at people it disappears. So we're gonna engage him. He's poisoned now. This guy's gonna run over here. I don't think he has the range. He apparently didn't need the range. That's kind of wild. Okay, I'm a tan. What can you do? We're gonna have you do a weakening blow. I kind of want to have you. Oh, you don't have the 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 movement, unfortunately. Oh, I'm a tan has first aid. We actually have first aid again. That's amazing. Let's have you run over here, and then uh, we're gonna do. We'll just do a, a, a normal attack. Your <laughs> his attack is so bad right now. That's fine. He should he should be able to keep keep up. Okay, Nevelina um, is gonna come over here and start stomping on this guy. I get some valor, so we're gonna use that right away. Um, we could potentially wrath them, but I, I'm kind of burning through my valor. It would be better to keep it. Well, my dude here just went ahead and poisoned his teammate, which seems kind of wild to me. Um, Mimesis. Mimesis, if Mimesis comes over here and then does a thing like this, pop, pop, then we get a free attack, basically, and then we'll do an attack like this. He's probably going to move out of the way. I have no illusions about that. Oh, he actually didn't. He actually moved more in the way, which is fantastic. Okay, we're going to go over here and we're going to finish this poacher off. 
I was really hoping that would crit. It did not. So we'll just kill him. Um, good enough. So this guy, if he moves into... The yes! Mimesis gets the double hit for once. Oh my god. Hooray first first aid. Actually, yeah, you just made me re remember. Um, him having first aid is great because we can actually um, get rid of poison. So I'm going to have Mimesis do her attack first because she never gets it. There we go. And actually, she might be able to kill them here. Double kill. Oh, Mimesis. Mimesis hulks out and just destroys everything. <laughs> that was so good. My dude, you just killed your teammate. <laughs> he just killed his teammate. And now he's got he's got six stacks of poison, maybe? I can't tell. But okay, he's engaged with him, so that means um poor lay. Orle is gonna hit him from behind. And actually, we're just gonna kill this lad. Unlock the trait, Glorious. Your opponents want to flee. Uh, nah. Nah. No, no mercy for these lads. Nah, we're not gonna use it, Poison. Four damage, wow. Consider me unimpressed, honestly. Um, I, 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 I'm a tan, my god. I'm a tan is, uh, he is not doing a lot of damage, but he is taking a lot of damage, which is also good. Sometimes that is more important, I would argue. Um, I should have had him cactus engage with, with, oh, this is Mimi. Oh, never mind. Okay, um, can, does Mimi have a turn? No, okay. Uh, well, that's a shame. Because those guys over there are not going to be able to do anything. That means we're going to probably take a bit more damage. Um, uh, what I'd like to do is have Cactus stun this guy. He failed. Missed. He takes six more damage. Okay, let's have Mimi come over here and attempt to knock him out. There we go. Mimi Mimi got the knockout. Still, uh, yeah, we, did, we didn't take any, like, extra damage. It's just armor, which is great. Um, yeah. Things are going very well right now. I still need, I need to level up Cactus. Okay, so Cactus, what do you get? You just get some points. You don't get, really get anything. Um, we definitely want to increase your strengths. Let's do career plans, strengths. I feel like you should just always do career plans if you can afford it. That's just like very good. Um, you have just completed the mission, Vanquish the Vivios Gang. Improvised Burning Stake. What is here? Is this anything? I guess this, mm, okay, Inquisitor. Oliaras. Oli <laughs> Oliarius. That's a mouthful. What? Ah, the witch. Her house has been struck down by the light's wrath. We require no further proof of her sins. I am not a heretic. Oh, please, you must believe me. I don't know why my house was beset by the light. How are we to burn this witch at the stake? All our wood was ruined by the rain. If we try to set it on fire now, she... The prisoner will agonize for hours. We cannot do such a thing. We are not monsters. Could you possibly donate a few logs in exchange for our blessing? I don't really want to do that, to be honest. Um, not for not because I want her to suffer more, but because I I would actually like to try and grab her from this. We can grab this wood, though. Steel. We're almost wanted. Any other things to take? Doesn't look like it. Okay, we're leaving. Oh no, he jinxed it. Quick, quick save. You know, you know, you're not wrong. 
save name uh doing well I immortalized in a save file now okay we're gonna head back to town there's that town that is beset by wolves over there i'm a little bit curious about that yo do y'all are you guys refugees no okay um i need to talk to some merchants because we got big big money now do you have anything cool you've got some salt i could always use more salt and you do have some raw materials okay we've got we've got salt uh i guess i didn't need that salt ironically because i bought some salt in preparation to make bread this guy you're gonna come in here we're just gonna have we have to feed these guys is the worst part honestly we're gonna go ahead and throw this wood in uh in the camp chest so we can sell it um we're going to cook make some bread That gives us quite a bit of experience. We jinxed it. Quick port, quick save. Yeah, the the I don't know. Like I could try and um, save the lady. Pay our wages. And um, okay, oh, it's an uneven amount of. Oh, sorry, it's an even amount of food, which is not a great thing because that means that. Yeah, we're gonna be slightly over still. That's fine. Danger level 30%. That's not good either. I've decided to opt instead of uh, getting extra valor to get extra happiness. And actually, we're kind of um, breaking even right now, which is really good. Like, we almost get a full bar of valor. Um, but meanwhile, we're making... we're Everyone's key, staying at 15 happiness, and we actually get bonus, which means we get bonus influence. The bonus influence is very good when someone levels up because then we can just like get extra experience and stuff so um yeah things are going very well right now i would like to make a strategy table that's the next thing high ranking companion assigned it generates one valor each extra during each rest um we we have the lectern we do have the lectern um i need the scholar for that so someone would have to be a scholar. I don't want to talk to the police because the police are going to question me about my stolen. Actually, technically my bread isn't stolen because even though we use stolen wheat to make the bread, <laughs> that's really funny, actually. Like, can you imagine the cops pull you over and it's like, Where'd you get all that, uh, where'd you get all that, uh, bread? Well, we made it. Yeah? Out of what? I'm, I'm gonna jump into this. You, you there, if you're so inclined, you could give us a hand, but if you're just loitering about... Okay, we're gonna attack. We're gonna attack the boars and dominant sow. This gives us some extra influence. Wait, what? That's so confusing. Why does it boars get extra bo allies? Go ahead, call the cops. They can't unbake the bread. <laughs> yeah. This is their captain, Perosine. Um, I'm assuming that if he dies, we lose the combat. Yes, correct. Okay, so we're gonna have to, uh, as quick as we can, engage a bunch of boars. Okay, Granoff and Imatan on this side. But in the meanwhile, uh, we're gonna go ahead and run over here and engage a boar. Let's go ahead and weaken him. Because we get that... Valor back. We could actually kill this boar. I don't want to kill this boar though because I want to kind of choke this space off a bit. So 
gain some extra valor for that. Um, Mimi is going to run over here. Oh man, Mimi could potentially get like a triple attack here. Ah, oh, come on. Yes. Pop, pop, pop. Mimi runs. Mimi runs and destroys. I don't think she's going to get to do that attack, but, you know, one can try. Now the Sal, that, that is uh, tricky. He's just going to run in the mud. Foot, foot soldier, okay. Um, Cactus is going to go ahead and engage the dominant sow in the mud. Um, yeah, we don't need to do anything more than that. Oh, Mimi actually gets the, atta the, the attack off. Poor lay go slay, cactus attack this, you know. Oh, I, f I forgot to call it, uh, change your name to I'm, I'm a bonk. I'm sorry about that. I'll change it uh, after this combat is over. This four is not engaged, so if I have poor lay go in there, he's actually gonna engage it, unfortunately. I'm gonna have him come over and attack the sow, actually, because that's great. He can't kill the sow, and then we're gonna get some extra valor. Um, except I actually have a full bar of valor. So let's use some valor and the, the the sow is almost dead now what are you gonna do don't i swear to god don't kill anyone i need okay that's fine that was actually totally fine what are you doing dude what are you doing why did you do that are you running away This dude is just like running off. Why are you, why are you running? Why are you running? I can't I can't do that without feeling I, I won't I won't won't lie uh, slightly problematic. <laughs> Smack. Oh, I needed to do Mimi. Wait, no, never mind. Now it's the new turnover. Mimi is going to crush. Crush Mimi! <laughs> Yo! Mimi, destroy! <laughs> oh my god. Mimi! Mimi got a triple kill. It's okay to sound slightly problematic when quoting memes. You're just repeating what other people said. Well, by that logic, then when I uh, listen to very specific rap music... <laughs> listen, I'm just saying. <laughs> Uh, I'm just saying that, you know, it's a slippery slope and the slope it, it does keep slipping until you are in hell I love that that triple kill for Mimi was was pretty pretty good Why are you running he <laughs> he's just running away he is just running as fast as he can. Okay, we're gonna use this weakening blow. I'm his hand really does need a better weapon. I promise to get I'm his hand a better weapon than this. Sorry, Mimesis. You already got your triple kill. I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna sugarcoat. I ain't gonna give it. Give you another one. 
This guy's gonna get the kill on the sow. Oh man. Wait, there's more? Oh. This guy over here. Okay. Uh, I guess, um, Cactus actually has really good movement, so he can, like, almost get all the way to the other cell. What? Glorious. I have to... Oh, is Glorious, like, you have a chance to get more, um... Chance to generate one Valor at the end of turn. Yeah, okay. So, whose turn is it? Is it Granoff's? Whose turn is it? It's Porlay's. Oh my god, Porlay, calm down with your movement. Holy. Holy jeez. Get the crit. Ah, uh, I didn't get the crit, so now I can't kill this thing. Get the crit. Eat the food. There we go. Can I get some pelts for this? Yo, we got food. We got some pork and leather and grease and pristine fangs. And I still need to figure out how to sell these. Or did you for your help? You've gained 20 influence. Yay. So where does this... Oh, that's like all the way back at the original, like my starting zone. Okay, there's apparently something there. Whatever. Let's sell some stuff. Things are doing very well right now. I'm, I'm very pleased. We should be able to take assassination missions now. I wonder where those, what those look like. Okay, so... Eloria Liss's squad must be stopped. The guard seems unable to deal with the issue single-handedly. We can take that. Um, I don't know. Nah, I just accept the offer as is for now. I'd rather keep my influence. And apparently in one hour, uh, they're gonna have some new missions. So let's just, we'll, we'll hang around for a bit. Maybe we'll have some pork stew. Recipe pork stew. Two bean, uh, two pork, beans, and salt. How much is this? This gives 14 food. This recipe might be uh, kind of worth it. It's, we could, I mean, we have enough pork to make three of these. Hi, that guy. What are we doing? What, what guy, that, what guy are we watching? What game are we watching? Uh, we're playing, uh, we're playing War Tales. It's a um, kind of an RP sandbox RPG with uh, a, a lot of heavy tactics and um, a bit of kind of XCOM-ish, like, um, you know, character maintenance. Like we, we, oh yeah, let me, here. I have to rename my Matan to I'm a Bonk. Um, I'm naming characters after people in chat. Um, and uh, we're, we're getting very attached to them before they die, if they do. But we're doing really well right now. I, I've, I've been struggling at this game for quite a long time. Um, so we're finally kind of reaching a point where I, I don't feel like I, I'm super suffering all the time. Um, Bannerlord? Is it like Bannerlord? Let me have a look at Bannerlord. Oh, isn't Bannerlord... Um, uh, is that what I think it is? You, you're talking about Mountain Blade? Are you talking about uh, Mountain Blade or the Banner Saga? There's a little bit of Mountain Blade in this. It's a little bit more methodical than uh, Mountain Blade, I think. I haven't played Mountain Blade, I have to be honest. I, I, I would like to. We have an Outlaw's Tunic. We might want to equip someone with that. Does anyone need this? Nope. Granoff? Nope. Porlay? Porlay actually already has an Outlaw's Tunic, but for some reason this one is better. Oh, it's exactly the same. Never mind. 
Um, Mimesis would lose some guard and critical damage. She would gain some armor, though. I'm not sure what guard does for someone. Is it, like, damage reduction? I think I'm going to sell these, this outlaw tunic. And I'll sell these daggers. Actually, does Porlay have a... Wow, Porlay is using a damage dagger. Uh, just, just wow. Oh, I sold a better one. Damn it. This, this damage dagger was plus five dexterity. It was a full two dexterity more. Damn it. I really got to check the weapons before I sell them. Oof. Can I name the next horse? You totally can. I don't know when that's going to happen. I'm going to make some hedgehog stew today. It's my greatest gift idea. Get that damn hedgehog. Oh boy, I'm going to make some hedgehog stew in the afternoon if it's the last thing I do. Ah, oh, get that hedgehog. And the emeralds too. I don't know why uh, Eggman is now a pirate. Arr, have they done a Sonic in like the high seas? There's something there, maybe. No, we're not doing the rat infestation. We're never doing the rat infestation. I'm gonna get that blue baboon. What? Curse the... Curse those monkeys. I'm gonna get their crystal coconut. Guys, remember that show? No, you don't, because you're not, like, a thousand years old. No, you don't remember that show. <laughs> I just realized, uh, I'm a tan. You could have also been an apothecarist. I should really get on this apothecary business. I, I don't like apothecary because it's so needy and it's also very expensive. Even when you, uh, like, uh, I don't know how to put it. Yo, salt's on sale. Buy that salt. What do you have? You've got pike. I think I know how to make pike. You also have pork. Pork and pike. Um, I'm very tempted to buy that pork and beans stew. Because I can buy the beans. We could buy some beans right here. They are kind of expensive. I'm sure it works out. I'm sure the food works out. Like, I know we have tons of food now, but, like, the ability to turn a renewable source of food into something actually good is very tempting. I'm gonna do it, guys. I know it's I know it's a bad idea. I know it's a hundred it's a hundred coin, and up until now, a hundred coin has been like a ridiculous amount of money, but I'd like to do it. We'll also gain a bit of knowledge. Yes, I want to learn pork and bean stew. So we're gonna get some beans. Look up hedgehog stew in YouTube. I won't lie, um the idea of Pork and bean, or sorry, not pork and bean. Hedgehog stew kind of makes me sad because I know hedgehogs make for nice pets. But you know, it's it's. Uh, I'm not I'm not shaming you for making that. I promise. Um, but like, it's an interesting thing. You know, like how different parts of the world, like different things, are on the table. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, um. You know, I I know there's a like there's this really kind of almost um, tone deaf joke about uh, in certain places in the world ha like enjoying dog and cat in terms of of you know like what you're allowed to eat, and it's a little bit uh, it's a little bit weird, and I don't think it's actually true anymore. Uh, give me a second. I need to buy three beans. But I'm, I also want to buy some pork. So I'm going to buy three beans. How much pork can I buy? Oh, I can buy ten. We'll buy four. Four pork. And that means we need two more beans. I just spent a lot of money, I know. But I don't think I have to worry about, like, food for a long time. I mean, remix of Do Dr. Robotnik singing about hedgehog stew. Oh, I, I mean, okay. Uh, you know, your boy Bimple got got a little bit there. Um, but like, 
you know, also, uh, I, I wouldn't be surprised if there are places in the world where hedgehog stew is on the table. No shame. <sighs> yeah, that was, that was me. That was me. That's what happens when you are, uh, like, open to too many ideas, you know? you just, like, open to whatever. Okay, so we're, what we're going to do is we're going to make some pork... Uh, uh, pork stew. Do 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 do, bop, doop. We got some craft bonus, and now we have a knowledge point. So you know, buying new recipes is great because it uh, it means you you have an extra, you have a bit more um, knowledge to play with. This is the the requirements to getting new knowledge are becoming kind of insane. Um, offer hunters increases the number of contract by one the number of contracts displayed on your list of bounties. This seems very tempting. I'm very tempted on that one. The maximum valor increased by one. Artful dodgers. Uh, chat. Do you want to throw an idea out there for what I should take? I'll tell you what I'd like to get, but I don't think I want to spend a point on this, is I'd like to learn how to make uh, a hammer for Imatan. Or sorry, Imabonk. I can learn how to make the two-handed mace here. You played yourself. I did a bit, didn't I? Chicken wings, which is the best sauce for it? BBQ. Um, I'm not going to learn any more recipes. We are good for food. I can finally and like legitimately say that I don't need any more food. Bonus carrying capacity. That doesn't seem like it's going to be worth it. I should, I could do some trading missions now. You know what I like more than a brand new horse in my barn? Knowledge. <laughs> yeah. Okay. This prisoner can be wary of the troop or trust them. I What I'd like to do, actually, is I'd like to find the local prison. I have to imagine they're pretty close. Spicy sauce on my chicken wings. Buffalo, yum. Heck yeah. So there's St. Elior Abbey. I don't think I'm ready for that. That's, uh, that's an entire... I don't know. Maybe that's not a mission? Oh, do we have a angler? I think I don't. Yeah, we don't have an angler. Okay, so no free fish for us. No fishing mini game for me. I'm really excited by the prospects that we have a full week of food now. Um, okay, so what do y'all have to say? Don't tell the abbot I said this, but Lord Vernalis, a sudden vision of Jeru is a bit strange, don't you think? I've been praying daily for over 20 years, and the guide has never once spoken to me. Have you come to pray for the soldiers' recovery and the victory of Lord Vernalis? You really should, you know. Lord Vernalis is a devout man. Jeru came to him in a dream and identified him as one of uh, the one true ruler of the land. It is my holy duty as an abbot to help him. That is why I'm tending to his injured soldiers. But I so wish I could do more. Perhaps if I paid you to take on a number of specific tasks. How would you feel about stopping that usurper Lehart? Uh, Lahart from levying his taxes. This would lessen the burden on the farmers and I could feed the injured properly. Uh, sure. 100 gold? Yeah. Blessed be St. Elior. Um... Lahart's tax collectors never miss a chance to ransack Berthis. Berthis. <laughs> uh, I will take you to the hamlet, hamlet so you don't get lost. Recruit? What the? Abbot Theokin? Uh, I don't I, I can't do some of the pronunciations on these. But we are off. Our, our troop is getting quite large. Lorge. Is it because of the bones? Chicken wings are the best thing a chicken has to offer. I disagree. Okay, you know what? Maybe I agree. I agree. I'll agree with that. But 
Pilgrims come to this altar to make offerings to Saint Septimus in the hope that he will protect them on their holiest of journeys. So we could just like 100% take all this stuff. Uh, I imagine that there are consequences to this, but I'm going to go ahead and assume that I am built different and, you know, God has no no plans for me, honestly. Um, I like I like chicken wings a lot. Um, but I also just really like chicken. Chicken is one of my favorite meats. Wooden statue. Okay. Silver brooch. Fish hooks. We are kind of getting up there in terms of our capacity. Oh, fresh mint. I like this game we play where I try and find... Select a warrior. No one is a warrior. I have no warrior. Meat is bad for you. Maximize the flavor. Minimize the amount eaten per second equals happiness. Yeah, I mean... I know I know we have uh, research to um, suggest or imply that, uh, yes, in fact, meat is bad for you and you should not eat meat. This is also true for... Um, Alcohol, by the way, apparently even a small amount of alcohol, like no amount of alcohol is the best amount of alcohol is, is our new findings. Uh, what is this? Heranime? Heranime? I don't know. Who are you? What do you mean attack? I don't know what's going on. Legionary. Duelist Sapper. This group seems surprised to see you. Okay, we'll leave them. Uh, this is both this village. Oh, I see. This is our mission right now. Location defended. Arrest Lehert's men in Bothius. Okay. So this is our mission. Now, I love me meat, love me booze, love crack cocaine. Simple ass. <laughs> Yo, bet. Chicken wings are the best. Uh, is it because of the bones? I thought people who drank one glass of wine each evening were supposed to be the healthiest. Have I been lied to, Big? Big Vintage? Um, I can't say. And you know, like, I know it's a cliche at this point to, to make this claim. But um, something that really bothers me about speaking objectively about health, um, just in general, is... It, like how why how how can one do that like um i i think that it's just like you know you're always gonna look a fool um because though we do understand um a lot about how you know our our nutrition works for sure um we do know like you know certain things are good and bad maybe but like it's just so many times and i know i know it's a cliche and i know like what this sounds like it's like oh do your research you're gonna you know you gotta figure out what's good for you and actually holistics are very good for you know i understand that it's it's all gonna sound like phony baloney nonsense but i really think like the number of times i've heard that you know x good y bad and then y bad x actually good though um it's just like it it really doesn't do a lot for one's faith in in like i don't know it's not the the health industry i don't it's not that i don't believe in the health industry it's that i don't believe that people themselves understand <laughs> like it's just very hard for me to um you know take things at face value uh, it, like a, a very heavy dose of skepticism on my part you know um, you know, like, uh, for, for instance, uh, fat was for the longest time, um, claimed to be one of the worst things you can put in your body. Like, don't put fat in your body. Don't eat fat. Can't eat that. That has fat. Fat is bad. Bad fat. No, no. A finger wag. Don't do it. And then 
oh actually it turns out the sugar industry has been like hardcore uh you know like doing this propaganda like non-stop for the last 30 years or even more than that like 100 years not even and and fat is actually like good for you like you need a certain amount of fat and uh, you know that that claim has never not been made like you, your body does need fat um but also uh sugar <laughs> sugar bad <laughs> like sugar bad and so you know like i i it's easy yeah I, I'm, I'm sure someone can can ask the question and very fairly uh well bim but bimple how can you believe that you know sugar bad if if you don't believe in any objective statements about health or food or nutrition you're right you really you really just kind of have to pick your battles um i i don't know like generally speaking what i believe yeah Porle is not gonna do much good over there actually uh i really do not want Porle to engage with this guy i regret this immensely okay i'm just gonna have to end his turn he'll get valor from that so it's valuable even though i make fun of big x or y all the time there's truth to that lobbyism is real and so are fake studies and fake or intentionally misleading data yeah yes i like i am not a nutritionist i'm not a health expert in any way so uh take even what i say with a grain of salt but not too much salt because salt is bad for you actually too much sodium can lead to health risks and heart problems there's your there's your one joke for the day but anyway um yeah i i don't know it's it's you know it's a serious problem that we uh people have made for themselves we've made it we have a serious problem guys i don't know if you know this or not but like we people have <laughs> have a huge problem um because we have like a hundred percent created like this massive like resistance of faith like we we can't basically believe anything right now and uh my god what is that not like a serious problem um like hard stop bimple made it real again oh no this is why Bimple should not be trusted on the internet. Just <laughs> Bimissy is just gonna run back and forth. <laughs> Yo, I love that actually. Mimesis isn't even gonna use her hammer anymore. She's just gonna run back and forth through dudes. <laughs> uh Wait, are you French? French actually eat a lot more vegetables than most people. Case in point, the famous ratatouille. And most French have never eaten foie gras. Fo foie gras? I know what foie gras is. I've never seen it typed like that. Foie gras? I still won't confirm or deny my nationality. Yeah, and you don't have to. Please do not if you don't feel comfortable with that. I want to know how bad coffee is. How bad is coffee for me? Oh! <laughs> oh man. That spelling is very sus. It is a bit. Okay, uh, Granoff, you're gonna have to run oh that's overwatch yo i that's the first time i've seen overwatch in this game i'm gonna have to figure out who my main is is it is it diva yo there's our second joke for the day you're welcome i can confirm that i do speak french bonjourno <laughs> <laughs> Ew. 
I can't be trusted with a stream. It's too much power. Uh oh, that's a heavy. That's a that's a big amount of Overwatch right there, bud. Okay. Um, I'm a bonk is gonna 100% just take this damage. Coffee bad. Mimesis has uh has shown her true colors. Coffee bad. Tea good. This is this is her hill. This is her hill. <laughs> Coffee booed. Poor lay. Poor lay. Whoa, you can't walk through that rock? Okay, whatever. The hill I die on. <laughs> Coffee is okay if you add enough ice cream and sugar to it. Maybe I add vanilla extract. Woo! Oh yeah, that that got me a little bit, Neville. I won't lie. That that kind of got me. Re. Arr! I mean, uh, War Tales is being very kind to me today. I I it's like it it, it heard me and my pleas of like, my God, uh, this is like becoming an ordeal. And today it's just it's just being very like chill and fun and I appreciate that. Raw Oh, I got a text. Who's texting? Who's texting me? Oh, it's my mom. Um, it's my mom, 280 grams of sugar. Love that sugar. And you know, I like it. Listen, you know, I'm not saying, uh, I'm bimple. Like I, I, I am not exactly a role model. I definitely put bad things in my mouth hole. Uh, I mean, okay, listen, I definitely meant that to sound uh, like dumb but like after on, on further uh, retrospect i realized that that was not necessarily what nature intended for bimple too much information bimple well okay listen listen all i'm saying is that pie is good okay oh my god oh <laughs> mimesis oh my god 50 damage mimesis calm down Oh my god. The wind up on that was so good. Holy crap. That was one of the best wind ups ever. I'm gonna see if I can't capture this dude. He's gonna do some one damage to I'm a bonk. Mimi smash the ground. Oh, you can't reach that. What about Granoff? Can you reach him? Yes, you can. Nice. We're gonna we're gonna capture this dude. We're gonna capture this dude. Why can't I capture him? Do I have to be like in a different spot to him. Whatever. I don't care anymore. Mimi smashed. Oh, he's not a he's not a he was not an outlaw. That's why I couldn't couldn't capture him. There's no point. Valuable Gambison. You guys know about Gambison? Y'all, y'all know about that Gambison? Y'all, you know, you know about that Gambison? Mercenaries, I have bad news. There is no sign of the tax collector's carriage. I think the men you slaughtered were only patrolling the area. But let's not dwell on such a trivial mistake. These people, may the light forgive me for saying this. They deserve to die. Worry not for your salvation. Killing heretics is not a sin. I don't like this path that you are leading me down. And this is why you never trust religious people in video games. I have another idea. The tax collectors always cut cross a small bridge not far from here. We could ambush them. Why are we doing this? 
did you pay me at least my dude did you pay me you, we i did the job this is this is what annoys me i did the job i did the job that you told me to do okay now um like the thing is right is maybe you have a new idea and maybe the you know things did not end up the way you intended for them but like that's not my problem that's not my problem you paid me you, you promised me uh, like a, a certain amount to do you know like you you promised me a cut or, or a commission for a job and i did the job so now you don't just like oh well that wasn't correct and now the the job you know the terms have changed no I did the job you asked of me. You pay me now. Hate that. Okay, I want to... Yeah, there we go. We have all these prisoners and they're really... They're making things annoying a little bit. People drunk on how bad energy drinks are then order Oreo TM coffee from Starbucks Which has like half a kilogram of sugar or something. You're not wrong Oh my god, that, that good. That was good at Oreo TM coffee Hey, co uh, cactus has something to say Just a little more effort and I'll make a name for myself. Even the legion will want to hire me Daydream. Daydream. Stay dignified. Whoa. Suggested by Mimi. Well, we have to do that one, right? How is Celebrate not... Not, uh... Not, uh, not... Suggested by Mimi. What do you guys want? I kind of like Stay Dignified. Only because that, that influence bonus is really nice. However, plus one relationship with close companions seems good. And I'm pretty sure his relationship is with Mimi. Uh, your relationships c companions can build relationships between c two companions ranging from hatred to love can evolve depending on their interactions so he has plus one like for mimi was cactus very social before no not really he was kind of a recluse but mimi is bringing him out of his shell dang Coffee is good when black or milk or cream. Other stuff is just plain bad. I will continue to consume sweetener. I'm sorry. Friendship. Yeah, we get a little bit of influence from this as well. Love, can we craft new companions? <laughs> oh my god. Mimi is just being Mimi. I think we gotta celebrate. Uh, Cactus and Nevelina ha relationship is improved. Wow, Cactus formed a friendship with everyone, but except Mimi. Boo. Um. Can we only put stolen things in this? Place the items you wish to keep in this chest. Launder the items stolen during rests <clears throat> little by little. And me, I'm the new awkward dude. The only awkward thing about I'm a bonk is his weapon. We gotta find him a better weapon. Poor Lay, can you wear Gambison? Cannot equip medium armor. Okay, so it counts as medium armor. What about... Granoff could wear Gambison, and it would be better for him. So let's do that. Oh, look at that. That is some nice Gambison. If you don't know about Gambison... Um, I only found out about it recently. Um, if you don't know, uh, I did a pretty extensive uh, Vintage Story series. The Vintage Story series, I was often um, recording with a friend in um, in uh, Discord. And um, they would tell me like little trivia tidbits about some stuff like, uh, you know, uh, what what that thing does how how smelting actually works stuff like that um, And one of the interesting things was Gambison, which is that uh, you know people never they didn't generally wear armor in this in the like 
cliched sense of having like plated steel or plated iron or chain mail or any of that stuff like all of that high fantasy stuff is kind of um very much phony baloney like no one wore armor like that uh instead they wore gambeson uh gambeson is basically a, a many many layers of thick cloth um so yeah imagine just like a whole army of like stay puffed marshmallow men charging into battle that's kind of uh what what you got and um yeah uh the, it was very very hot like wearing many layers of of that was uh was was pretty hot business is paper armor gambeson then paper armor not sure I know what you mean. Unstable bridge. Should I walk over that? I'm not sure what I'm trying to accomplish here right now. Is that maybe? No, that's a fishery. Is it this guy I'm supposed to do something on? We'll save. Oh, okay. Legionary Sapper. Okay. CDDA devs dunked on Gambesons by making them super hot to be in. It was a premium piece of armor back then. Like the Japanese historical paper armor, which was composed of so many layers of paper that it could be could stop swords. <clears throat> well. Um, it certainly sounds similar to Gambeson, but I cannot say one way or another if that is officially Gambeson or not. Gambeson, you know what? Let's learn something. How about that? Hold on a second. I'm going to look it up. Gambeson. It's got a funny word, isn't it? Gambeson. Uh, also, Akaton padded jack, poor point, or arming doublet is a padded defensive jacket worn as armor separately or combined with mail or plate armor. Um, Gambesons were produced with a sewing technique called quilting. So, if we're going by some kind of hard definition right away, that would um, mean that paper armor is not technically Gambeson. They were usually constructed of linen or wool. The stuffing varied and could be, for example, scrap cloth or horsehair. During the 14th century, illustrations usually show buttons or laced up the front. An arming doublet, also called Akaton, uh, worn under armor, particularly plate armor, or 15th or 16th century Europe, contains arming points for attaching plates. <clears throat> now, I know what you're going to say. You're saying, well, Bimple, you just said that they, don't, they never wore the plates. Um... You know, there's different, I, I I would say that there's different forms of gambeson, and yeah, they could put plates on them, but like the idea or the traditional, or, or I should say like stereotype of like layered pauldrons and like plated steel and stuff like that, it was, it was very rare and it was mostly like, uh, you know, people of like high renown, like, you know, what do you want to call them? Generals? There, there weren't really generals back there, but commanders would likely wear that kind of stuff. So those guys are way over there. We all know that the most historically accurate representation of that time is done by For Honor. <laughs> I've heard good things about For Honor. I actually played a little bit of it. Um, a friend of mine tried to get me into it, and I was like, nah, I don't need another career. You know, that's kind of what it came across to me as. Oh, shoot. I, I made the crucial mistake again. I wasted Valor. Damn. Okay, well, we'll, we'll use this now. It's a fun game, but sadly, it's multiplayer. Yeah. Your Honor objection, like the Japanese historical people... So, I, I would say that um, maybe Gambeson means something specific, and therefore it has to be made from wool and linen and stuff like that, Neville. Um, it also generally, as far as I know, refers to specifically a Western, like, 
I guess not Western. What am I? You know what? I'm not historian. I'm like, his, like historically, I'm really bad at history. <laughs> so I, I'm not, I'm not the one to ask. I should look into this a little bit more. Ain't no one got time to socialize. Ah, uh, yeah. For honor, I, like, I, I just like I, my, my time and patience for competitive multiplayer games is gone i i don't have it anymore um you know what let's run over here and absolutely destroy this lad destroyed um get encourage this guy's gonna run over here i was kind of hoping he'd run into the trap oh wow he smacked me backwards so no lol after all <laughs> do y'all actually want me to play league of legends like i'm not completely opposed to the idea only because it would be hilarious <clears throat> it would be genuinely hilarious to watch me play uh league of legends because i am really bad at that game i am absolutely horrendously bad at that game i don't even know honestly how to play it that well i do genuinely want to you to play it for the lulls my it's a double-edged sword i'm afraid because like um perception is a big thing and i i would hate for people like anyone who follows me for like a specific kind of content on youtube you know like oh say i, I don't know tactical games caves of cut traditional roguelikes and then they see Bimple is playing League of Legends. <laughs> um, you know, my reputation would be in, in tatters. Oh, Mimesis. Mimesis loves to run. Mimesis is a endurance runner, sprinter. <laughs> I genuinely do want uh, people find suffering entertainment. Um, so like, there are other ways for me to suffer. I was, I, I, I've kind of posed this question before, but like, what about the idea of me like trying to find some really bad games, like a pack of bad games and, and playing those instead of Lee? Like, I'm like, what, would y'all rather me play Fester's Quest or something? Like, I'm like finding any, anything, anything but, but League, no. Fester's Quest. Fester's Quest is a notoriously bad game on the NES. Uh, <clears throat> Mimi. Uh, I don't... Wow, okay. I, I kind of played this badly. That's fine. Just do it in a stream and title it appropriately, like, Suffering for the Sins of My Stream Chat. LOL. Big plays Tim Horton's Roblox map and runs uh, runs about coffee for 30 minutes. Simple reputation will be ruined. Oh, no. I mean, I honestly think that there's a better, like, there's. I think that there's an understandable layer of irony in me playing Roblox. Whereas if I play League of Legends, there's every opportunity for someone to, uh, you know, think that I actually enjoy League and, and then turning the channel into a League of Le Tell you what, I'll do it for... I'll, t I'll do it when I hit 3,000 subs. How about that? There. Done. Easy. Easy. Oh, no. Someone's gonna eat, like, 10 damage here. Okay. Uh, it's gonna be poor lay. I have premium suggestions for bad games. Oh boy. Oh boy. Nice. 
I have managed to throughout this combat only spend one actual valor um because every single time I've I, I've spent a valor it's been immediately after I've gained a valor which is really nice oh Gonna go ahead and go over here just to make space. Deadly premonition and Y2K. That's not a pinky. Pinky square, that's not a pinky. <laughs> uh, that's really good. Uh let's go ahead and wrath this guy dead. Nice. That's not a pinky. Mimi is going to crush, destroy. <laughs> That's not a pinky. <laughs> pinky sir. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm still laughing about that. <laughs> <laughs> That's really good. <laughs> I absolutely love hate those two, and if you're looking for so bad, it's good time. It's th those two. I thought Deadly Premonition was good, though. Parlay just keeps taking extra damage. Uh, I want to engage this archer right away so that they don't keep doing that stupid overwatch. Oh! Oh! Nah. <laughs> nah, Deadly Premonition is on Hunt Down the Freeman level. Really? Uh, you do make a very convincing case, I'm a tan. How long is it? That is definitely a factor. Oh my god. Ah. Wait, Porlay has become a duelist. What? Yo, what? What does that mean? Uh critical hit and critical damage increased by 5% when a one-handed weapon is equipped. Oh, okay. I want him to wield two weapons. Uh, I got some Legion Battle Plate, which sounds amazing, but it looks like hot trash, I won't lie. Grand Off leveled up. Grand Off is going to... We're going to go ahead with extra constitution on Grand Off. Grand, Grand Off has just a absolutely absurd constitution right now. Hey, Kevbo. I'm still morally offended that Bimple has made me so interested in a freaking beta early access game. Is this in, this is in beta? This, this game is in early access, yeah. It's very polished for being in early access. No info on how long it is, but I do remember it's not that long. All right, you're making, uh, you're making me consider it. I, I am, I am thinking about it. I will think on Deadly Premonition. I definitely want to do Y2K because that game does genuinely look like, I'm sorry, awful. I'm not sorry to anyone in chat. I'm sorry to potentially the people who made it. So what what is the deal here? 
Oh, I have to go to the bridge. Ah, you're pretty fast. Let me catch my breath. Let's see. We're here because, yes, the ambush. We're going to destroy this bridge. The caravan will be forced to stop, and this time you can attack it without getting it wrong. Go ahead and demolish those pillars. I shall pray for Jeru to give you strength. Okay, Mimesis is going to smash bridge this time. Mimesis, smash bridge. Ha! Ha! Crush. We got some experience. We got some sandstone. Oh my god, we're actually getting some nice stuff here. This guy's gonna take the credit. Just watch. He's like, yes, you managed to destroy it so efficiently because of my prayer. Go and stand in front of the bridge. They will be there any minute. Okay. Wait, Bimple is thinking of Y2K and Deadly Premonition. I hate that I'm following this guy. I, I truly do not like this quest, I have to say. Let's see if Legion Battle Plate would be better for anyone. I don't think it would be. Certainly not for Imatan. Uh, no, not for Granoff either, who's got that Gambison. What about Mimi? Ooh, Mimi. Mimi could wear it. Oh, Mimi can't equip heavy equipment. Okay. Never mind. Uh, Legion. Uh, well, okay. 26. Oh, never mind. Yeah, okay. That Legion, uh, Legion battle plate is actually hot trash. So you're telling me I, I thought that I was going to be... I already fought the dude, but in fact I did not fight the dude. We're going to be fighting the dude now. Why has this bridge collapsed? Who are you? Where is our patrol? Level 4. Y2K is a beautiful, terrible mess that is funny because of how bad it is. I hate loving it, and I love hating it. Deadly Premonition is amazing, good, in the same way Twin Peaks is good. I haven't seen Twin Peaks, so I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, I don't know what that means. Leader's Opportunism. This unit's attacks also deal 5% damage to health. Okay, we gotta get rid of the commander right away. They are there. Let us arrange things appropriately. This guy's gonna fight first. Let's see if I can't get to this commander right away. Uh, actually, let's put Porlay there. Mimesis, you're gonna be in the back. Cactus is going to fight the commander. Get rid of that buff. There we go. And let's give him some extra protection. You approve. Jeweler Porlay. Y2K is also awful and everyone will agree with you. Deadly is very janky but charming in a way. I had a friend who played through it. <clears throat> um, I, 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 I'm tempted on that one. Okay, we're going to have Porlay move to the back of this guy. And we'll get some extra. Actually, let's do some poison damage to these lads over here. It is charming AF, but it is janky. The director's cut makes things a lot easier. Oh my god, Nevelina is now going to take overwatch damage. Uh, I'm a bonk. Can you do anything? You're right in the mud. Why did I have to put you in the mud? Granoff, can you reach that archer? No. They have they have a very good um, choke point right now. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll take a little bit of Overwatch damage. Ouch! Man, that hurt. <clears throat> Okay, that was that was a whoa. Okay, that sucks. Destabilizing strike. 
Get that back. Slice. I like this back-to-back -back play here. That's pretty good. Um, I'll go ahead and do uh, protection. If you're really going to play Y2K like recently before the next big overhaul update, I will buy it for you on Steam right now. But only if you call it by its proper name, Yeek. Uh, okay, well, here's the thing, lads, is I I'd be game for this. However, I I a stipulation is I need... I, I, I like. I know I'm in charge in terms of the scheduling, but I, I want to know, like, something's got to go at this point. I'm playing four games right now. Five if you include Katamari, right? And I do, I was actually going to suggest we finish Katamari today. Um, so what's, what's, what's going? Like, we're doing Weird West. Um, I'm actually really enjoying Call of Pripyat, so I'd be game to do more Call of Pripyat at some point. Um, Mutation, Spirit Fair. I, I, at this point, I need. I would like to to have closure on uh, Spirit Fair because we we've made it pretty far into that game. Um, Weird West. I'm sorry. No one enjoys Weird West. Okay, Weird West is is gone. Uh, if someone vouches for Weird West, uh, do not feel like like even even if you think that you're alone, I, I'd like to hear your. Like, I'd like to hear from anyone who thinks that, you know, who enjoys Weird West. Um, brutally honest as always. Do you know about D4 Dreams Don't Die? I'd say Weird West or War Tales. I actually like both of them more War Tales, but I feel like the gameplay is similar enough that you don't only need one. Hmm. I might try Weird Weird uh, West on my Steam Deck, because then I could play it on my own. I like Weird West a lot, but I understand <clears throat> I understand why it's the unpopular choice. Oh, that's a good encouragement. I don't think I want to get rid of War Tales. I enjoy War Tales too much, and I, I I think that we should continue with it. War Tales is fun because of the chat engagement. We're all rooting for our own avatars. Yeah, like I, I, I think that War Tales uh, is, it's got staying power, and I think that it's, you know, enjoyed enough that it, it should stay. Um, is anyone poisoned? No, we're good. Okay, this duelist is gonna go. Luckily, you can attack in Overwatch without um, provoking it. Damn. Wait, did my guy die? Uh, who was your guy? Granoff is still alive uh, if he's your guy. The only one who's died is actually Andrino. He was the only one that died in the circumstances in which I was comfortable actually making his death canon. Does that make sense? Oh! Oh, damn! Poor Lay. Damn. I guess I'm Granoff now. Wait, Kevbo, that was your guy. No one. You didn't have a guy outside of Granoff. I don't think you ever had a canonical dude. Weren't you the Donkey Bill? I, I don't know now. <laughs> this guy is tough. Get destroyed! Oh, I'm 15? Honestly, I'm disappointed. Okay, uh, wondering, can we, like, do something very sneaky here? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Maybe something like this? Uh, no. Okay. All right, well, let's just set up another attack. It's fine. Oh, my God. Jesus, dude. 
he he also has a charge every death is a cannon unless it's mimi that's right the only time that i reload is if it, mimi dies uh i didn't even have a guy i guess i'm granoff now do you want me to change granoff's name to um wait what what was that that just happened can someone iterate to me what what was just on the screen for a moment I can change Granoff to Kevbo. I'm happy doing that. I, I always thought that Granoff was your dude. Change Gran's first name to Jack. I would have named him Jack instead of Grant. Well, who's... Okay, if it wasn't yours, then who is Grant's? Because I don't want to cheat someone else. Oh wow, we just got two Valor points for free. Um, oh my god, dude. Stop stealing Mimi's power. No, Jamie. Oh, I'm sorry, that's not my bit. Mimi was like, stop doing that thing that I do. That's my thing. Mimi crush! Mimi destroy! Mimi hate things that are not broken. That's why Mimi became a miner. Mimi likes to break things off of walls. Um, all right, what's, what, what are we doing with this guy? Let's let's do a, a very small amount of damage and then crush him. Absolutely. It's okay, Bimple. I understand. I'll just be over here in the corner. I'm fine. All right, fine. Granoff can be Jack. Damn. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm gonna take you up on your yeek offer. By the way. A hundred percent. Guilt works every time. Wow. Unless you follow it up with, haha, got him. It kind of negates the guilt a little bit. Somewhat. <clears throat> Nevelina is going to be taking some actual health damage, and that's not good. So we're going to spend some hard valor to lessen that. Oh, dip. Okay, I think I'll need your Steam ID so I can buy it for you. Um, all right, let me give that to you right now. Why is, why is Chrome flashing? Stop flashing, Chrome. Because uh, here's the thing, guys. Like, if y'all actually want Y2K, I was going to get it, but I was going to wait for it to be on sale. But it's not going to be on sale anytime soon. So, you know, there it is. <clears throat> um, sometimes, you know, a big simple has to be a misery fool. Hold on, where is my... How do I... Get my friend code. Where's my friend code? Uh, add friend. Oh, here we go. Copy. <clears throat> I'm going to drop it in. Um, should I drop it in? Yeah, you know what? Here, I, 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 I trust that this will not be abused. My friend code is in the YouTube. You can all add me as a friend if you wish. Uh, nah, we won't do that. Lo-fi smashing sounds to study too. I satisfy people's needs with relaxing smashing videos. Let's get that Y2K happening, yeek sweep. Hey, Damathorin, how you doing? How is you? Damathorin, was, was, uh, Granoff your character? This is, it's important because, uh... Kevbo is trying to to uh, turn them into Jack. Oh, <laughs> I just like threw 
threw them under the bus. Another companion has started their turn. Return. To oh, okay, yeah. I'm going to end that turn. Why? All right, please crit. Oh, wow. All right, we're going to spend even more valor. I would rather spend the valor than... Uh, than uh, take some extra damage. Is this going to hit my friend? Ugh! Looks like no. I, I, dude. This is why I need a ranged character. Oh, we can knock him out. Maybe. Yeah. We actually did. Oh my god. Tyrannical. Cactus got tyrannical. What is that? Increased by two as long as... Willpower increased by two as long as there are prisoners in the troop. Oh my god. I don't know how I feel about that. I only want to chain Granoff's first name to Jack. Granoff, but you didn't like the name. Grand Oaf? Okay, but Damathorn, it's not that I didn't like the name. It's that he he earned the title Granoff because he kept running off. Y'all, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna become a villain. Dimethorn's, uh legitimately making me feel guilty now. If I change his name, can't do it. There's a, 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 a conflict here. Granoff, keep, he must... Have the ran? What the hell? <laughs> yeah. The mimesis. I don't know what that sentence is. For. Get sniped. Oh, he he still gets to do his Overwatch, huh? We just need another big. Let's change his first name. Okay, his name is now Jack Grandoff. Okay, we're gonna compromise. Everyone will be happy if I give no one what they exactly want, right? 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 Uh, is this guy in range? Oh my god, that's fine. He's just gonna take some armor damage. It's it's actually not fine. Oh, it is. I guess it is fine because now he's he's done. I hate that no one can reach this guy. He has like the perfect positioning. Negative seven dollars. <laughs> Negative seven dollars. You got played. His name is now Big Simple. How about them? How about them apples? I I don't have a character. Where's my character? Kill him. I was about to put seven dollars on your coffee. I guess I won't be doing that. Where what? Where's Imatan's stake in all of this? I don't under how what excuse me cactus has become a protector um let's take constitution yep let's repair our armor oh no I didn't mean to do that repair armor <clears throat> Someone is going to end this without their armor being repaired. Because I don't have enough materials. Wait, what? I thought I repaired Nevelina. What isn't repaired right now? Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, never mind. Yeah, you're like halfway there. Okay, uh... Well, that's everyone. Everyone's repaired now. I don't understand. Weird. 
Oh god, wait. Was Weird West the first or second video of the day it's played? I'm gonna buy Bimple Yeek and then not be able to watch it. It was going to be the first, Kevbo, so it'll be the first game on Thursday. If that works for you. Since you are buying the game, I would like to be accommodating for the schedule so that you are able to watch it. I think it's varied. It, it's like I've been trying to find a like a convenient middle ground pending invites. All right, y'all have to tell me what your names are in chat because I had a bunch of pending invites and I don't know who is who. That's literally perfect. I will be intoxicated during the Y2K stream. Thank you, Base Bimple. Yeah, no worries. I, I'm glad. I'm always happy if I can actually make people happy. It's it's a it's a rare occurrence. <laughs> perfect time to get drunk. Yes. Um. All right. What is going on? I need to sleep. We're gonna have some pork and beans. Um, let's have some carcass with that. Does this have one food? One food! I actually managed to make everyone happy. Amazing. You should be able to tell which steam person I am. Big. Who else would have the name of Dippy McShit Pants? There, there you are. You are friends. Uh, Bimple Giga Chad. The stream makes me happy alone with Chad. Perfect. Um, is anyone in chat Cali Commuter? I just like tell me what your name is so that I I can like uh, add you as a friend. I have the thing open, so I you know, whenever. Okay, so what what is happening here? Did I complete the quest? I apparently did not complete the qu report to the abbot. Okay. Praised be Saint Ella Elior. Praised be our guide Jeru. P praised be the Great Eye. We've done it, mercenaries. This is wonderful. It is a blessed day indeed. Layhart won't dare venture into these parts anymore. I'll spread rumors that the caravan was struck by the Eye's wrath. Yes, all their soldiers will quaver, quiver, quaver in fear. I'll do so upon my return. Also, I do not wish to unduly profit from your piety, but would you be so kind as to escort me? to St. Elior Abbey. I will give you a well-deserved re reward as soon as we arrive. Attack the abbot and keep the food for yourself. If I do this, do I get my money? I don't like this guy. Chat, I'm going to actually leave this up to you. I'm going to leave this up to you. I don't like this guy, but I, I also don't know what I should do here. Because, uh, you know, like, I don't know if I'll get my money if I attack him. Wait, so you're taking friend requests on Steam? I am taking friend requests on Steam. I know, Diamond Thorn. I, 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 I am... Uh, I, I, I understand. <laughs> really? No. What? Monday is French for Tuesday. Thank you for fueling my alcoholism. Like, at this, uh, destroy him? No. At this point, like, it, it, I don't, I don't see it as being, as, as really meaning much anymore in terms of, like, accepting people on Steam. Like, um, yeah, I don't know. It's, it's a weird thing. Like, I, I know this is, like, a whole, um, breach of, like, well, how, how, how actually friends are we? The answer is exactly this relationship here. And our history just gets thrown under the bus, shaking my head, JK. Um, I, I actually do want to address this. Thank you, Kevbo. I appreciate you. I do want to actually address this. Um, Dimethorn's actually making an important, um, reference here because... Uh, at one point, I was not actually okay with people being friends with me on Steam. Um, because at the end of the day, there has to be, like, some kind of, like, line drawn between how actually friends are we. And I think most of you are, you know, mature enough to understand that 
The answer is not really. Like, it is, like, we're friendly, and I'm, you know, but th the distinction is I am a streamer, and we're all, like, enjoying whatever entertainment I can provide, if if any. Um, but, you know, at a certain point, I, I did not, like, let people be steam friends with me because it, it felt like a weird breach of that. Like, at a certain point, I don't want to set expectations that are going to be betrayed down the line, meaning like, oh, we're friends and therefore I can, you know, ask this of you or we can do that together kind of thing. And I'm like, well, no, because, you know, like, I, I, I don't want you to feel like, uh, you know, we're not friendly, but there has to be a line drawn at, in terms of like my privacy, in terms of like uh, me being comfortable with people. Um, and I know that's a weird thing, and it's not a really easy thing for me to even describe. So that's why I didn't want to be friends with people on Steam, because it felt like I was setting up weird expectations. I know this isn't even, this is not even a comfortable thing to discuss, but like, yeah, like uh, at, a, at a certain point, I want to create an environment, create an, a community for people to feel comfortable in. I want to create a fun space for people to feel like they can hang out with people and, and have a good time and not feel miserable. Um, but th that doesn't necessarily mean that I can be your friend. And I know that's a weird way of putting it, but I have to, I have to literally draw that line there. Um, otherwise it's going to be, it's going to be uncomfortable down the road. Um, that being said, like I, you know, I hope I've explained myself well enough without being like mean. I, I don't want to be mean, and I, like I say, I want to create a fun space for people. But um, you know, hence my hesitation when it came to adding people on Steam, is and also to creating a Discord. To be honest, I, I don't know if creating a Discord at this t time was probably a good decision because. It's early enough that there's like, you know, four or five people on there and yeah, we're having a good time and, and discussing the parts that like matter uh, as, you know, in, in terms of my stream and stuff. But like, I've been in this position before where I've created a discord and like, I'm not saying that this is happening now, but like I have been in, in positions before where it's like, I'm trying to do something semi-professional and running a discord is like almost an extra hobby and it creates these weird kind of relationship dynamics and it also means i have to moderate people and i hate moderating people <laughs> but anyway that's a lot of stuff i you know dear diary today bimple finally accepted my steam friend request the road to our future marriage is mature i appreciate uh the levity um, just bought and sent it. I'm gonna go nuts with the Steam friend thing. You can remove me now if you want. I literally just wanted you to send the game, and I appreciate that. And I, I am going to, um, uh, I'm gonna say this, and then we're done with this conversation because it's not exactly fun for stream. But like, I trust that everyone here currently is mature enough to understand the dynamic that we have. That's it. Uh, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm a username in your chat. I've listened to you talk so much. I thought we were besties. Yeah. <laughs> I love that YouTube let my psycho comment through, but it shadow banned my comment saying Bimple can remove me from his steam if he's uncomfortable. It's your channel, Big. You make the rules and we follow. I, I know that, and sometimes I have to remind myself of that, but I really don't like telling people... Like, I don't like disappointing people. It really is, like, my worst fear. And, you know, like, like that's... You know, as personal as I'm going to get on here, but like, I really don't like telling people no um, and and making them like sad ever. <laughs> so hence why I don't like moderating people, because, you know, at, at the end of the day, if someone's in in my discord saying s weird stuff like, you know, uh, I don't know, I, I don't even want to like create a paradigm. But like if they're saying stuff that I, I'm like, I, I cannot allow that in here because it's going to make other people feel sad and miserable. So no, and go away. Uh, you know, I'll give you a good example. If someone's in my discord peddling NFTs, there we go. That's, there's the line. I'm going to, I'm going to have to 
Guys, do we want... Should I kill this man? I'm disappointed that Bimple doesn't want to tell me no. He's made me sad by not putting me in my place. I have Bo revealing to the world that he has uh, uh, some, some kind of kink. No shame. Someone puts these high expectations on you, it's kind of their problem. I, I mean, that you're not wrong entirely, but at the same time, it still makes me feel bad. <laughs> like, that's... there it is. Kill, maim, destroy. Thank you, streamer, for putting your foot down. I now understand you are doing it for the right reasons. As a chatter, I am grateful to your steady hand guiding. Ugh. He's an NFT bro kill. No, I meant it in all seriousness. I was really going to give you a reward. Well, if you were going to give me a reward. Was the reward an NFT? This really is the darkest route. We're gonna open the open things up by kicking them down. Oh snap. Tell you what. Tell you what. Let me let me see something here. Oh, if I was gonna, if it, if it let me, um, like, take him prisoner, I was gonna do that. Mimi, kill! Unlock the tree, glorious! <sighs> well, I guess I get nothing from that. Um... You killed Abbott Theocene. He's here's hoping no one finds out you have gained uh, 25. Okay. Oh, look at all that money, uh, all the food I get. Actually, this is not bad. That's not a bad reward right there. Could be worse. Did you just destroy that innocent man? He wasn't innocent. He was a jerk. Hey, Bill leveled up. Yo. At level five, he gets some new abilities. Let's give him some more constitution. Heck yeah, Bill. Um, I really want to find where the prison is on, in this side of the world. Ooh, iron. Heck yeah, bud. Oh. There's a combat over here. Uh, you know what? Actually, let's leave it there. That that's a good two-hour chunk of War Tales, uh, along with uh, you know, many other things. I'm gonna save, and I'm gonna return to menu. And that's a pretty good chunk of uh, content right there. That that works well. I'm gonna go to the washroom real quick, and then um, we're gonna move on. Uh, are we cool with me doing like finishing Katamari today between this and Spirit Fair?